This installation video will demonstrate step-by-step -step how to install the Axis 36-inch curved shower door. Before starting work, protect the shower base from damage by covering it with cardboard or similar material and tape over the shower drain to prevent loss of screws or other small parts. The first step is to assemble the curved frame. Two people are required. The post with the magnetic strip is to be on the side that the sliding glass door is on. Using the M4 by 35 screws, assemble the two posts to the bottom horizontal rail. Install gaskets on the top and bottom of the fixed panel using the glass clips to determine the starting point of the gasket. Next, insert the fixed panel in the groove of the wall post without the magnetic strip, ensuring that it is fully inserted into the groove. Next, use four M4 by 35 screws, attach the top horizontal rail to the posts. Using the M4 by 12 screws, Secure the two glass clips to the top and bottom horizontal rails. Next, insert the fixed panel gasket into the gap on the inside of the fixed panel and post. Start about three inches from the top and press the seal in working down the panel. Then press in the remaining three inches portion of the gasket at the top of the panel. A helpful hint is to press against the gasket with a wooden dowel and slide it along the length of the fixed panel. Finally, trim any excess gasket as needed. With the shower base and walls installed, use a level placed at the outside edge of the shower base to mark a vertical line on both sides. Then position a wall post 1 and 1 8 inch from the drawn line. Ensure that the wall post is plumb. Then mark the location of the mounting holes on the wall. Remove the post and using a 1 quarter inch drill bit, Drill holes where, the, where marked on the wall. Install the wall anchors and plugs. Use the M4 by 35 flat screws and fasten one wall post to the wall. Repeat the process for the second wall post. Section three, fitting the frame assembly into the shower opening two people are needed to accomplish these steps successfully. Place the completed frame on the shower base and insert the ends into the wall posts. Be sure that the frame is centered on the shower base and that the frame is fully inserted into the wall posts. If at this point the installation of the sliding door needs to be changed to the other side of the enclosure, the frame needs to be rotated 180 degrees and the top and bottom rollers on the sliding door must also be swapped. If the rollers are not exchanged, they could release from the track and the door may swing out from the track. Most importantly, the bottom rollers are not intended to support the door. Not exchanging the top and bottom rollers could result in the door breaking. Section four, installing the sliding door panel into the frame. Place the top rollers in the top horizontal rail. The next step is to pull the bottom hooks down and insert them into the bottom rail. Install the knob handle set on the sliding door panel as shown here. Next, install the side gaskets on the side of the panels, ensuring that the flange of the gaskets face the other panel. Section six, fixing the frame to the wall posts. Using a 1 8 inch drill bit, drill eight holes in the frame posts, using the holes in the wall posts as location guides. Using the M4 by 8 screws and washers, secure the wall post to the frame post. Then place the screw cover caps over the screw heads. There are two steps in the final section, section seven. First, install the wall jam and extender caps on the top of the wall posts. Finally, apply silicone between the wall posts and shower wall and bottom of the frame and shower base. Allow the silicone to dry 24 hours before using the shower. This completes the installation of the Axis 36-inch curved shower door. Please reference the installation guide for cleaning and maintenance of the shower door.